we now discuss the solution of a problem from the section matrices and determinants the problem is related to the concepts of matrices this question has appeared in the joint entrance examination main held on 29th june 2022 in the second shift the given question is let a be a 2 by 2 matrix whose first row is 2 minus 1 second row 0 2 if b is equal to i minus 5 c1 multiplied by a joint of a plus 5 c2 multiplied by a joint of a square minus etc minus 5 c5 into a joint of a to the power of 5 then the sum of all the elements of the matrix capital b is we are given four options option a minus 5 option b minus 6 option c minus 7 option d minus 8 we are given a 2 by 2 matrix capital a whose first row is 2 minus 1 and second row is 0 2 and further we are given capital b is equal to i minus 5c1 into a joint of a plus 5c2 into a joint of square and so on minus 5c5 a joint of a to the power of 5 required to find the sum of all the elements of this matrix capital b we now discuss the solution of the problem in detail we have this capital a this 2 by 2 matrix and it is given capital b is equal to i minus 5c1 into a joint of a plus 5c2 into a joint of square minus 5c3 into a joint of a cube plus 5c4 into a joint of a whole to the power of 4 minus 5c5 a joint of a to the power of 5 If you see this one carefully, this is the, the binomial expansion of i minus a joint of a whole to the power of five. Yes, we recognize this as the binomial expansion. So that is equal to i minus a joint of a whole to the power of five. Let's call this as m to the power of five, where m is i minus a joint of a. now if a is a 2 by 2 matrix how the adjoint of a is given by a is the 2 by 2 matrix a b c d then the adjoint of a is given by this so flip the diagonal entries that is ad will become da and change change the signs of the anti diagonal elements bc will become minus b minus c so if that is the case a is a is equal to 2 minus 1 0 2 then a joint of a will be by this formula this is uh, flip this two elements 2 and 2 1 and the same therefore 2 2 and change the signs of the anti diagonal elements minus 1 will become plus plus 1 0 is 0 and i minus m is equal to i minus a joint of a i we have written the identity 2 by 2 identity matrix minus a joint of a that is 2 1 0 2 subtract you will get minus 1 minus 1 first row 0 minus 1 so now we multiply m with m so m square is m with m and multiply will get 1 2 0 1 1. and we take m square we want m to the power of 5 therefore we take m square and multiply m square with itself then you will get m to the power of 4 and that will be 1 2 0 1 multiplied by 1 2 0 1 is uh, after multiplication 1 4 0 1 so this is m power 4 so we want m power 5 so m power 5 is equal to m power 4 multiplied by m m power 4 is here m is uh, 
m is uh, minus 1, minus 1, 0, minus 1, multiply, you will get uh, the minus 1, minus 5, 0, minus 1. Thus, we got m power 5 and we want, uh, we want this m power 5 is precisely b. This is, this is b. And uh, now, we have b is equal to i minus adjoint of a whole to the power of 5, that is m power 5, is equal to the minus 1, minus 5, 0, minus 1. Required to get the sum of all the entries of m power 5, b, of the matrix b. So, the sum of all the elements of the matrix capital B is some of these things minus 1 plus minus 5 plus 0 plus minus 1. So, if you add all of them, then you will get minus 7. So, the sum of all the elements of the matrix B we have obtained as minus 7. Let us look at our options. Our answer minus 7 appears against option C. Therefore, the answer to this question is option C. And that is the detailed discussion of the solution of the given problem from the section matrices and determinants. It is a very simple and straightforward question. I am sure that you have understood the solution of this problem and I wish you all the best. Thank you.